Hi ladies and gentlemen, welcome to IT Snippets. Today I'm going to show you how to use an incompatible USB drive to install Unraid and boot from it. So let's get started. So the first thing you have to do is download the offline version of Unraid. You do that by going to www.unraid.net. Click on downloads. And then instead of selecting the information here, you scroll down to manual downloads and click on the manual download option. Just click on the latest version. I've already done so. So we'll just close that for now. I'll just copy the Unraid version over to my desktop. As you can see, it's down here. Now what I want to do is I want to place a disk in the drive, a USB key that I wish to use, it's incompatible. In my case, this is drive E. So we have to format it correctly. We right click and we select format. FAT32 is fine. 4096 allocation units is fine. We have to make sure that the volume label is unread in capitals and quick format is fine. So we'll just click start on that. And it'll say warning, format and all the result date on the disk. To format this disk, click OK. To quit, click cancel. So we'll select OK. Give it a moment. OK, now we can click close. And we can close again. So what we have to do now is we open up our Explorer. As you can see, I have. We scroll down and we select our Unread disk. What we then have to do is select our downloaded file, which I placed on my desktop. There it's there. So we'll double click that to open it up. Just expand this a bit for you. Okay, we want to click on it. We want to do a Control A to copy, or select everything rather, and then Control C to actually copy it. And then we go over to our Unread folder or our new drive. And then we do a Control V to paste it. And we'll give that a moment to copy across. Okay. Now that that's been copied across, we need to make some changes. If you have an EFI BIOS, then you have to rename this folder to just EFI by taking the minus sign off. And that will give me the EFI version. And then what we want to do is we want to double click Make Bootable. Oh, it's told me it must be run as administrator, so that's fine. So we click close, we right click, and we run as administrator. We say yes when user account control kicks in. It says, do you wish to make this disk bootable? So we click any key to continue. And it says complete, and we press space. Now, in spite of the fact that this is an unsupported USB key, if you plug this into a system, it will boot up Unraid as expected. If you liked this video, give it a like. If you disliked this video, give it a dislike too. If you get feedback in this or any other videos or suggestions for videos you believe we should do in the future, then please let us know in the comments below. And most of all, thank you for watching.